Hello, I am back. This is Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. I hope you missed me last week. I missed talking to you. Last week, Pam and I was out at the Holy Convocation of the Church of God in Christ in St. Louis, Missouri, and it was an awesome time. Uh, our presiding bishop got reelected, the general board. Uh, most of the general board members got reelected, and we have two new general board members, Bishop Darrell Hines and uh, Bishop uh, uh, Williams from, uh, from Florida, Darrell. Hines from uh, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and the Lord is blessing our church. But tonight is so important. I laid on the floor uh, in my home last night, and I said, God, what's next? You know, we've been talking from a courageous uh, 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 a series, and we've been preaching from various places. In our leadership, we're studying the book of Nehemiah. In our 8 a.m., we're studying the book of Jeremiah. I tell you, we're in the word of the Lord. There are a couple of messages that God is dealing with me about, but I sought the Lord about where do I go from here starting this Thursday night? And I've been talking to the Lord all week, and the Lord uh, didn't say anything. And I said, well, Lord, it's Wednesday night, and, and Thursday is coming. And uh, I was at home, and I, I, uh, I, I laid on the floor. And uh, I, I actually, I, I kind of fell asleep, you know, maybe a little sleep deprived. I don't know. But while I was sleeping, the Lord spoke to me and told me where to preach from. And I got up and, uh, and then went on upstairs and went through my nightly ritual and w went to bed and had a good night's sleep and got up this morning and came here and began to prepare the word of the Lord. Now I want you to meet me tonight. I want you to meet me tonight. We're starting a, a good Bible study. We're coming from the word of the Lord and you know that the word of the Lord is always relevant. I actually say that the Word of God is more up-to-date, more relevant than tomorrow morning's newspaper. And that was back in the day when you could, you know, trust the newspapers to actually report the news. Today, most uh, news outlets have a slant and an agenda. So when you read their stories, you got to read them and read between the lines to see what's actually being said. But thank God with the Bible. God's word never changes. You don't have to read between the lines. The word of the Lord is right. Meet me tonight at our, our Bible study. I'm glad to be back in town and I can hardly wait to teach the word of the Lord to the people of God. I'll see you tonight.